A puppy waits outside for her turn. She may have a highly contagious disease, so her owners are keeping her outside of the waiting room. Crossing. Cranson? Cranson? That's me. Let me okay. text my son and let him know to come in. Christy is bringing in her little puppy, Minnie. She's 10 weeks old, and she started having a soft stool. She's thinking that it is powerful because it has very soft stool, and it's very smelly. Really bad. The family is right to be concerned. OK, we'll start with the back end. It stinks. We really fear that it could be parvo. Uh, she's having a lot of the symptoms for that. I just have done a little bit of research, and I don't know exactly what that is, and that's why we came to Dr. Cole. But he still eats, right? Yeah, she's been eating just fine, okay. as far as I know. Parvo is a viral infection that actually attacks the intestinal tract from nose to tail. The diarrhea is so severe that the, the young animals dehydrate so fast that they die. She's just really tiny. She's only about five pounds, and we're just really concerned. Parvo is a virus that is infectious for many animals. Even with the best veterinary care, the disease is often fatal in puppies. She was five pounds, I think, when we got her. How long have you had her then? Two weeks. Uh, yeah, two, two weeks. weeks. Okay. Temperature's normal. And I have some stool there. I'll check it for worms. I think that might be the more of a problem. Temperature's normal. She is not thrown up. And there's no blood in the stool. And then I take a stool sample and check underneath the microscope. And sure enough, he has worms. That's weird. He's got wrong worms, that's for sure. I thought he was wormed. Yeah, except the wormer kills the adult worms, not the larvae. And the next thing, here they are again. We want to check for powerful just to make sure. Yep. And you want, we'll do that for you. Would the worms cause the foul odor? Oh, yes. OK. And she says, I don't think I like that. No, I can't blame her. Powerful test. Dr. Pohl's confident that roundworm is the culprit, but he's performing a parvo test to be on the safe side. Negative. You think it's roundworms then? Yes. OK. And that's typical. Yay, no parvo. And I'll vaccinate it again, because the temperature is normal. I was very, very relieved that Minnie just had worms. Easy to take care of, something pretty simple. There you 